Hi there, Mark from UK ABC, currently holiday in sunny Spain. Something I thought I'd show you here, this is the Helicon Tex EDC sling bag. Really like this one, the wife's got her eye on that, she's been using it a lot of times over here while I've got another one which I'll show you later. So what I like about this sling bag, this is quite small and lightweight, you don't need a big huge bag, I've just come back from the pool. So here's some features on it. Up here, we've got a little zippered area where you can put something like your headphones. What I've got is my little chum's wallet in there with a bit of cash in there, pen. I'll go through the contents of that with you another time. Good thing about a sling bag as well. That's why it's called a sling bag. You can just sling it around. We've got a little pocket at the front here with a little clip which is hidden by this piece of fabric. And what I've done there is I've looped that around there. And then I've got some water. This is one of the Halicon Tex um, water containers. We did have two of these, but unfortunately Wendy lost one. <laughs> she dropped it down a rock. So we've only got the one now. And also in there, clipped around this piece here. I keep my keys and I've got a few EDC items on there. And again, that's on the Halicon Tex little keeper. We've got a main compartment at the front, which is a bit small. So you can keep your smaller items in there, so I've got some antiseptic hand wipe, some pills, a couple of bits and pieces in there, and open that one up. Double ended zippers on here, and again I've just got a book. That's a really funny book. If you're in the UK, buy that one, it's really funny. Um, I've got some noise casting headphones as well. And I've got, oh, this is another good little thing. This is the Helicon Tex Micro EDC Med Kit. And very, very small, very, very light, so very, very easy to find. You're not going to perform CPR or anything like that on anyone. Somewhere to keep a couple of little pills. I've got a couple of Gaviscon in there, a couple of anodines in there, some strong painkillers. I'm in Spain, so I've got some anti-diarrhea pills and a couple of like antiseptic swabs in there and some plasters. Great little thing, and that'll go somewhere else, which I'll show you about later. And that's the one pocket. And then we've got a slightly big oil at the back. I haven't got anything in there at the moment, and this has got a bit of a unique feature. Um, it comes with a pistol holder with the bag. Obviously, if you're in a country where you can carry firearms, this might be good to you. So you could essentially, I'll demonstrate this when I get back home as well. You could literally swing your bag around like that. You've got a quick access point there, and you've got quick access to the item you're carrying there. A handgun, for example. We'll do that at home with the insert as well, and I'll also go through the full specs of the bag. Okay, so we're going to get a second part to this video, so I'll catch you back in the UK. Cheers. Hi there, Mark from UK. See, back from my holiday from Tenerife. My wife actually had her eye on this when she used this bag, this EDC Helicon Tex Sling Pack. She used that as a travel bag going out, a travel bag coming back, and an EDC bag out there. As you saw in a recent video, I did some fishing out there. So what's great about this Sling Pack is I love the colour. It's made of nylon, but it doesn't feel like nylon. It feels much, much better than that. Quality zips, quality fittings, feels really nice totally adjustable and you've got these wind up things to take away all the extra straps. Um, I did touch on the fact it's got a rapid deploy pocket so should you be living in a country where you can carry a firearm and need to deploy it rapidly you can essentially pull this round here, grab this section here, pull that down and this is the holster where you place your firearm if it's legal for you to do so wherever you live. So that's great. Now you may wonder, I don't want it now, so you can actually put it wherever you want. This is part of Helicon Tex's versatile insert system. I don't want to go too much into this because I think it deserves a separate video on its own. But basically, you can switch between Helicon products which support this. This is my EDC little um, organiser here. So I could put this here for my EDC bag, which I'm going to look at in a minute. This is a two-part video on this one. And just pop that one in there straight away. Same again, this was while I was on holiday. This is an EDC pouch, which I'm going to touch more on. It's more of a travel pouch because you can hold your passport, some money in there. Um, you could pop that on there, close your bag up and ready to go. And if you do switch bags, take it off with a Velcro or hit the if you want to call it that, and put it in the bag. Great little system, I like this. So you can actually customise how you like the internals of your sling bag to be. Okay, so thanks very much for watching this. I've got a part two. What I'm going to do is I'm going to do the EDC backpack now. I'm going to do like a two for one video on it. And again, we can see how this works. So stay tuned and we'll have a look at the EDC backpack. Okay. Hi there, Mark from UK EDC again. Just been fishing, last day of the holiday. Just wanted to show you a couple of things. So we're wearing a Tilly hat. I do rate these, they're quite expensive, but they are a lot better than all that. And the backpack I'm wearing is, it's the Helicon Tex EDC backpack. Of course, you can 
got plenty of adjustment points on there as well. It's got a chest strap, it's got a waist strap, which I've taken off because I'm not really a fan of waist straps. Love the colour of this one, same as in the bag we looked at earlier on the EDC sling bag. So, very, very nicely made out of nylon. As I say, just been fishing, so you can just have a little bit of pacing on the outside to attach a couple of um, morale patches, some bungee on there for you. And we've got two pockets. One here where I've got my water bottle, uh, a couple of lures, some more fishing stuff, a Helicon Tex mini first aid kit, and in the main packet I've got my travel fishing rod, which is the Savage Gear Roadrunner XLNT. Um, not a bad little rod, actually about 80 quid, but folds up nice and small. I like to do a bit of fishing at home, and I do a lot on, on holiday as well. And I've got a reel in there, which is a Shimano Technium in a little case to want to protect that. That's quite an expensive one as well. So back to the main subject of this. This is the Helicon Tex EDC Day Pack made of nylon. It doesn't feel like nylon. It actually feels really, really good, really nicely made. YKK zippers, the normal things. As with these backpacks and the one we had a look at before, the sling bag, they've got a couple of little gimmicks in there which you'll find quite useful, which I'll tell you about when I get at home. It's called their VIS or versatile insert system and it's got a keeper hydration here as well and what I do is I've got another one of those elegant text keepers there and it's like a fold up towel. So a lovely little backpack, been using this one on holiday, the wife's been using the sling back and I've kind of been rotating between both of those when I've been going to and fro working around town. I've also got a hero clip on top as well, it's not actually a real one, it's a copy. I did reach out to Hero Clip and ask them to send me some samples, but they didn't. So I shouldn't really be mentioning them type I just send me some samples. Uh, so that's nice to keep up the ground. Well padded, well insulated, rides off of that nice. A little bit more of a top up review on this one when we get home as for the sting bag. Okay, catch you back in the UK guys. Hi, welcome back to the follow-up review of the EDC backpack from Helicon Tax. So once again, I do love this colour. It's a shadow grey colour. It's unassuming. It's grey man. You're not going to stand out. It's not tactical. On the exteriors, we have some Molly and Powers webbing. And I'll show you a little brief snippet of what we can use that for later on. Either side, just got my EDC pen on the outside there. A bit of webbing on there so you can put a coat on there. A uh, bit of ventilation on the back, we've got a nice little airflow in the back there. Nice and padded there so it doesn't bang on your back. The straps are nice and comfortable, fully adjustable, with a chest point as well. And the internals, remember we had a quick look at the sling bag just a minute ago. So what I've done is I've basically put my EDC pouch in there. There's a bit of a VIS in there as well, but we'll touch on that a bit later on. And I've transferred my daily EDC into this bag here. So that's the versatile insert system, but again, separate video on that one. And a nice big area at the back as well which is hydration compatible so basically if you get yourself that bag there and you get yourself a sling bag you've got pretty much all your EDC covered throughout the year so what I'm going to do is I'm going to quickly just throw something on here so just hang on one sec and I'm going to show you something else that this bag can do as well bear with me I just to finish up to show you the full adaptability of this EDC backpack from Helicon Tech what I've done is I've put on a couple of um, accessories on the outside so if your bag was a bit full and you wanted to carry something out just to show you we can clip on there we've also got a space up front so this is the um, EDC pack from Helicon Tex. I can't remember the exact name of it but I'll show you that in the uh, next video I do for those and I've got the Helicon Tex medical pack stuck on the outside there as well so if you are going for a walk on the moors finding space a little bit tight inside maybe you've got a couple of jackets in there or some camping gear you need a little bit of extra space you can of course just put it on your back here and here and out in some etc. This is my EDC backpack at the moment. I love it. It's great and it's very, very reasonable price. Check out the guys on the Helicon Tex website. Details in the description and the end of the video. And thank you very much for the guys for supporting me. Without the support of these guys, I can't make these videos for you. Okay, you take care of everyone well now. Peace out and much love. See you soon.